Well, it's fantastic. Um, I mean, it's, it's simple to see that if you want to attract players, you've got to have somewhere that they want to come to. I think it looks marvellous. It's about it's as good as the pitch that we've got down at uh, on Whittington Moor. It's gorgeous. Yeah, it looks absolutely fantastic. Pictures look great. All the fencing looks great. Just a fantastic setup. Really professional. Oh, it's second to none. You know, it's absolutely fantastic. I remember it playing here when it was the two works and that, and such an improvement. It, it, you know, the grass, everything, everything's good. Obviously, you would have saw, seen the training ground before yeah. it was it was redone. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. how vast is the oh, improvement? Hundred percent, isn't it? You know, it's totally. If you can't play football on this either, you can't play football. And how important do you think it is then for for sort of the club to have? a pitch like this and a training facility like this to move in the right direction? Well, the players have to play and train on quality surfaces and that's what they've got here. But not only that, you can bring in the youth, the youth of today, the ones that we want, and you can attract players, you can attract players when you've got facilities like this. And I imagine as a sponsor of the club as well, it makes it more attractive to sponsor the club when facilities like this are being made it's, for the club. You can support. see something, you can see something at the end of the day, what you've been working for for all these years. come down and see um, the new facilities. Um, we've been working so hard tr to get it to where it is today. Uh, Gary Roberts has been amazing. He's constantly been up here uh, telling me what he wants, what he doesn't want. Uh, so yeah, so we just wanted the sponsors. It's also great for the sponsors to see the team training. They do so much for us, they support us so much and it's, uh, you know, it is another way of saying thank you to them. We appreciate it so much because last season and while I've been here, it's, it's the training ground has been a difficult part of part of things, and this club's ready to go. So it's a League One club, the fan base, like the sponsors that get behind us, and the training ground was the next step. And it's fantastic. You can see here, just the pitches are brilliant. We can have proper sessions every day rather than going from place to place and training on astroturf, and it's just going to take us to the next level. So how how sort of important and vital do you think it is as a club for us to move forwards as a club and obviously sort of hopefully rise up the leagues to have a facility like this? Yeah it's, it's vital every every club that's in League One, League Two that want to do anything they develop the training ground and if, if you want to get better which we do we, we, we're, we're a team that just we've got young players need to develop you need to be on the training ground every day you need to get the gaffers input you need to get the coaches input and if you've got a good facility with pitches that are good quality and you can have good sessions every day you're only going to get better as a team. And so for the people that are, are, that are at home who are watching this interview who probably never saw the old training ground sort of were laughing because we both know it ourselves how much better is this a thousand percent can i say that <laughs> um at the moment because it's quite firm and it, the weather's been good it, 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 it it's better but it's not like light years ahead of what it is over there but when the winter comes it starts raining and you can't stand up and it's you're just getting in your car and you're just caked in mud cause you, it's not enjoyable it's it's, it's it reminds me of playing when I was a kid on a school pitch after school and it's I had thousands of games on it, it's just a mud bath and that's what it was now, it's proper, it's, it's like any professional pitch you go on, any really good ground and it's we're going to have some great days on here training in the winter and it's going to put stones in good stead in the, when the business end of the season comes. And then finally, how sort of important then and how much better is this going to make your guys' lives, you know, not having to travel, you know, acres to Mac Matlock, who obviously we are appreciative that we've been able to train there, of course, but now that we can just come here every day and we have a base, sort of as a team and as, as an individual player, how much easier and better is it going to make your footballing life? Oh, it's great because we're five, ten minutes from the stadium, we're coming in, we're, we're training, getting in at different times, normal times now, because we're not waiting for Matlock, which we really are appreciative of Matlock for helping us out during pre-season. It's great for us to let us use their pitch and probably did quite a bit of damage on it because we did a lot of sessions, but uh, it helps us out now when we start the season well, thanks to them. Um, but it's going to make it so much easier for us coming in every day, nice pitch, and you, you come in, you look forward to training, you see everyone's smile on their faces, just want to get out here and enjoy training. And do you have a final message to the sponsors that have uh, sort of allowed this to happen? Just thank you. It's uh, uh, amazing, like this club is the next step for this club and you've been a part of what's happening on the pitch this year and hopefully we can go on and be successful. Uh, 
very impressed. League standard training facilities, great, great facilities to encourage players to come to the club. I think it's really good. You look at a training ground, it really excites me. You look at the grass, look at the quality of it, and um, just the players, you can see how much they're enjoying it. I think it's outstanding. I mean, I, my last recollections of this field up here was playing football and cricket on it as a kid 30 odd years ago. So to see it as it is now, it's just stunning.